and welcome to a new solitaire video. Our journey to 1000 tonight continues with my most rare deck in my entire collection. Anyway, I hope your day has been well. You're ready to relax, play some solitaire. This deck is the hardest deck to find brand new. And here we have the Slurpee 7-Eleven deck in light blue. Now tell me that color just is the most satisfying look to a deck of cards. All right, here we have our regular Slurpee design on the middle. But this is all about that back. So, let's put a jokers and promos and shuffle up this lovely deck and you know what let's start off our night with a casino style shuffle my friend I'm excited I've had this deck waiting on the shelf for a bit and the time has finally come look at that loveliness Let's get into this, and as we do, please get yourselves nice and comfy. Alright, so as we get through, Finishing up our casino shuffle. What are your honest thoughts on the Slurpee decks? And if you don't like them, I am especially interested to hear that. If you like them, what do you like about them? And if you love them, why do you love them? If you're neutral, why are you neutral? Alright, there's the deck. Let's clear it up. And begin game number one. For me, what I really love about these decks are the little speckles of yellow, typically that go in the cards, as well as the liquid-esque splash design on the back. Just very, very satisfying. The only thing I think that could have some improvements are the front designs of the cards, but even though they are still satisfying, simple, sweet, and to the point. As we start off our night with an ace. some healthy building. Oh, triple sevens only momentarily, I should say. And triple nines, so a tough start. But you know what? This deck did not come to go down lightly. Expect a lot of fight as we begin our night and my bad, my friend. I know you're about to type it, but I got it, so don't you worry. From this point on, I am on my best of behavior, catching those little instances. Wouldn't that be funny if I just missed a play instantly? Despite its few 
shortcomings. Just the overall composition of what surrounds it is stellar. So no need to hold it back too much on its demerits. And I think that was three plays. So unfortunately we have to wait for that seven. Okay. I'm going to do a little bit of strategy here. So we're not going to play that five since that would be our third play. So next turn we can get to that seven. You see what I'm thinking here? And it would be just amazing if we had the Ace of Spades in our hand, wouldn't it? Alright, we could play that. That won't bring any issues, nor that. Ooh, lots of queens. Queens aren't too bad. You know what? I'm feeling a little goofy tonight. Shout out to all of those lovely queens out there. And all of you kings. Don't usually speak like that, but you know what? Feel an extra spunky tonight as we have our first fat stack to our left. And I am sensing a little bit of danger now four and two oh wow triple queens and just like that that is the end to our first game of the night as there's nowhere for that queen or queen try as we might all we could put down five six and then those are double black sixes so we cannot get to the red sevens we got a fat stack we had lots of plays strong start but you know we would like a little bit more and you know what i'm wanting a pina colada slurpee drizzled with a little bit of blue raspberry and a splash of pina colada, if I didn't say that already. All right, triple kings, double tens. My goodness, that makes sense.
best intentions. I don't want to stir you too much, but just know my interest will always be in your best interest type thing. And, oh, triple eight start. That's tough. Just want you to know that goes straight to you as well, even though it's kind of harder to really express that the way I'd like to, since I can't know every thing about you or as much as I'd like you to share and vice versa. It's still a start. Does that make sense? I hope it does. Anyway, let's just go back and focus on this game and hope we can pull up what they win instead of pulling up a bit lame. is it three I believe yeah our first game was pretty strong so it felt like two so let's clear it up and deal it out I swear we start with the three of clubs so much to our left for the first card just realized momentarily or we have a triple six start it seems like in our episodes lately we've been getting stung by the triplet bug quite a bit and there goes the triplet what am I doing putting the ace of diamonds up there 
guess I'm focusing too much on the field. That must be it, right? Definitely nothing else. King down two to follow. Actually, let's bring you back. Why not? As now we have a red king and a black king. A red nine, a red queen, and nothing in between besides another red queen, and a five that we've already seen, and a seven that's quite mean, and a king who needs to go lean. Okay, that was a little mean. Anyway.
comes off to you more relaxed and as well as for me being able to sleep afterwards fairly quickly.
as we have double jacks, double eights, triple eights, I believe for the second time of the night. But a king comes in swiftly to the rescue, as well as a second ace. This one looks like it's going to be, ooh, almost made a boo-boo. A tough one, but a fun one. Triple jacks with the triple eights. All right, now we're getting somewhere. This one has now become a fun competition. As something tells me I should wait. Let's do it anyway, as we get rid of our triple eights and triple jacks with one swift whack. Let's hope for another comeback before we hit the sack. surgery. 